Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 24th of 2022, well, it is titled The Deep Sky Behind an Eclipsed Moon. So what do we see here? Well, here we see a number of different objects in the sky and at varying distances from us from within our own atmosphere out to the uh, portion of the disk of our galaxy. And let's go ahead and label them here so we can discuss them a little bit. And the first thing we see towards the top of the image is the streak of a meteor. Now a meteor occurs when a small grain of sand or in this case is noted a fast pebble strikes Earth's atmosphere at a very high speed and vaporizes. So these are objects that never make it down to the surface of the Earth. They're much too small and they burn up in Earth's atmosphere. But we see them as a meteor or a shooting star. So these are actually within our own atmosphere. A little bit beyond our atmosphere and off to the right hand side is our moon. And in this case, we see the moon as it is totally eclipsed uh, from the eclipse that occurred just a just a little earlier this month. And we see the moon there is that deep blood red color as it passes into Earth's shadow. And as you may recall, Earth's shadow is not completely dark because Earth has an atmosphere. And that allows light to be scattered through the atmosphere and into Earth's shadow. And it's the red light that is better scattered through there into the shadow. So it gives the moon that deep red color that we see. Now we also see a gas and star clouds over in the central portion of the image and that is part of the Rho Ophiuchi system. And we can see that in the center uh, with a number of bright young stars and still having gas clouds and dust clouds around them from which they formed. So it is a region of a star formation. And then off to the far left hand side, we see a portion of the disk of our Milky Way with the great distant star clouds that we see. And you can start to see some idea of how these can be many billions of stars that are there just very close together. So when we look at the Milky Way with our eyes, we just see the milky patch, the glow of all of these stars. And it was not until we first looked at it with a telescope that we could actually see that it was resolved into many stars and that there were far more stars there than we could have possibly imagined before. So here we can see some of those star clouds and a lot of the dark dusty areas where there is more dust and that blocks out the light from behind. So we can't see all of our Milky Way disk simply because there is so much dusty material in between it. So we see the meteor within our own atmosphere, the eclipsed moon uh, off to the right hand side, some star clouds and uh, stars and gas clouds in the center, and then our Milky Way off to the left hand side of this image. So that was our picture of the day for May 24th of 2022. It was titled A Deep Sky Behind an Eclipsed Moon. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Lagoon Twisters from Hubble. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.